Hi everyone, welcome to this recitation. I'm Li Jing and I will be your teaching assistant in this master's and welcome to the deep learning family. Today, we will talk about a very useful tool named JupyterLab. JupyterLab is a next generation web-based user interface for Project Jupyter. It enables you to work with documents and activities such as Jupyter notebooks, text editors, terminals, and custom components in a flexible, integrated, and extensible manner. So today, today's recitation has two parts. One is the introduction and one is the G-Drive extension, which uh, we'll talk about how to connect JupyterLab to, to G-Drive. It will be very useful for our homework, especially when you use AWS. The second part will be introduced by another TA Mahar, but let's first start the introduction part. First, we have to install JupyterLab before we're using it. And here is a comment. Of course, you cannot install JupyterLab in the JupyterLab, but uh, let's just ask you the comment here and uh, you will see the same thing if you put this comment in your terminals. And the second one is uh, uh, called a comment and it has the same uh, function here. And if, if you want more details about the installation, you can just refer to the official documents here and you can see many other ways to install uh, the JupyterLab. And please remember that no matter in your local machine or in the remote notebooks, you can always uh, use pip install. Uh, com common to install new packages because uh, like uh, if you want to install Tensor, Py PyTorch or NumPy or P Pandas, you can just uh, use this comment like this. And then we can install a totally new uh, package here because uh, right here I have uh, installed the NumPy so that I will just show the requirements already satisfied, but it's okay. it will be fine. And it is quite simple to uh, start the JupyterLab. It just uh, enters the JupyterLab to your terminals. And let's have a try here that if we uh, tap JupyterLab, uh, JupyterLab here, and then we can uh, open a new, totally new uh, open lab here, uh, JupyterLab here. 